Hi everyone, do you remember a couple of weeks ago when I needed to borrow Nicole's guillotine? Well, while I was in her craft room, I saw these stashed in the corner. They're filled with resin crystals and cubes. Nicole told me that she'd been saving all her leftover resin and she made all these pieces. And when I asked her what she was saving them for, she said she was saving them for me. Isn't that nice? So on this week's episode, we're going to take all these pieces and make something cool. Before we start making, the first thing I want to do is tip these out and see what we got. So it looks like this container is just full of mini cubes. So it looks like this container is mainly filled with crystals. I can see a couple of little skulls in here. There's so many. I tell you what, let's play a little game. The first person who correctly guesses how many pieces are in here, I'll send them a Ben's Work sticker pack and a dragon egg from my personal collection. I'll even give you a helping hand. I've grabbed a handful of crystals and I'll let you know how many are here. 22 and one cube. Now while you guys are busy leaving your comments down below, I'm gonna start counting. One, two, three, four. Lucky last. That makes So now that I've finished counting, it's time to let you guys know what I plan on making. I've got myself this big container to use as my mould, and I plan on making a bowl. Do you think I could get away with calling it a crystal bowl? Normally when you make bowl blanks, you put a scrap piece of wood in the middle, that way it limits the amount of resin that you use. Now unfortunately I don't have a piece of scrap wood big enough, but I do have one of these jugs. Now I'm just going to zip tie that to the middle, and hopefully I'll be able to get it back out when it cures. Now that I've put it in the vac chamber and got rid of most of the bubbles, it's time to put it in the pressure pot. But because we're using a mould so large, 
we're gonna have to stick this one in Freddy. Wow, I'm speechless. This blank looks bloody amazing. There's just so much to look at. Well, after staring at this thing for the last 10 minutes, I guess I better try and get it out. Well, that's a bugger. I guess lucky these are only a couple of bucks. This blank looks so cool. I almost don't want to carve it up. Hey doll, have you had a close-up look at this yet? No, not yet. Come check it out. Oh wow, that looks so cool. I oh, know. Can you guess how many pieces are in there? Oh, I've got no idea. There's <coughs> Wow. I know, right? That took me like two years. Two years? You're joking. Better not stuff this up then.
that's looking really good. I tried to keep the wall nice and thick. I didn't want to turn away too much of Nicole's hard work. I think I got myself a new Halloween candy bowl. If you're a fan of the channel, you'll know that I don't often turn bowls, but I'm really glad I did this week, because this one looks amazing. Now don't forget, leave me a comment with your guess of how many pieces I used. I'll give you a hint, it's a lot more than you think. Now let's check out this bowl. <laughs> 